Most of our interns this year have come from App State. We do have quite a few from UNCC and then Winston-Salem State University as well. The goal of the Charlotte Mecklenburg Police Department intern program is to have our students work alongside department personnel in a wide range of assignments throughout the Charlotte Mecklenburg Police Department. Our interns are exposed to effective problem solving skills, building relationships, as well as obtaining a better understanding of the day-to-day -day operations that it takes to actually have our police department up and running. I grew up watching him and uh, watching him protect people and, and so it really made me love policing. Um, it's always been a really big part of my life and something that I've always wanted to do. After I don't know, probably three months of considering being a vet, I was like, nah, I, I want to be a cop. The best part for me um, has been really building the community um, with the other interns. Um, it, it's really family oriented, so you, you get really close to each other. I mean, you, you're with these people. 40 hours a week, at least eight weeks. Um, it's a lot of time to spend together. Um, so eventually you, you create a bond that's really special and really strong. So the first couple of weeks, our interns have been doing some ride-alongs. They've visited aviation, lake patrol. They've definitely gotten down with the nitty gritty of getting into PT some defense tactical training and things of that nature. So far it's going pretty well. We had a few that were not interested in the policing at all. We went from initially just three that were interested to seven currently and possibly 10 by the end of our program. I wanted to go into forensics. Um, being able to do the internship last year showed me that I don't only want to see one thing in my career. I like variety. My ride alongs really opened my eyes to everything that CMPD has to offer as well as obviously the academy experience. So I kind of made the switch then. And I'll be a part of the September class in 199. So I'd rather spend my summer being in the environment that I plan on being in for another seven months instead of chilling at home. I came into the experience last year with a lot of fears because I'm so quiet. But being able to put people at ease was a nice thing. Um, being able to see different divisions this year was key for me. We only stayed in one division last year, so I pretty much was thought like, oh, this is all police work is. But this past week, I was able to go to a different division, and that was really nice for me because it was a different speed and different types of crimes. I went back to school immediately and told everybody about it, especially people within my, my department. My professor, um, Dr. Rosalind Harrington, she used to be a homicide detective here. So she teaches a lot of courses. So she would have me come speak to her classes about my experience because I had such a good experience. So this step is crucial. Like I said, we have a lot that have no idea what the police department offers as a whole. You have some that are just doing it for hours, but then they come in here, they have that experience, they have that one-on-one -on -one connection that they're building and that just changes their mindset completely. They get to sometimes be hand in hand next to the recruiters or see the recruit process firsthand. Sometimes their classes are next door and they can hear the recruits and what they're doing and that piques their interest. They're side by side in the locker rooms, talking and building those relationships. They're riding along with the officers. All of those things kind of set the stone and set the stage for what's to come in their future. If you're definitely unsure, just give it a try. They're out um, and being exposed to different things that the department offers. So if you really just don't know what you're interested in doing or where your career is gonna take you, this is the first step in figuring it out.